Dear viewers, Assalamu alaikum from 20 Minute Online College. We are here with Winning Over English, episode 7. With the seventh episode, we like to start a Winning Over English program uh, on every Tuesday. We usually broadcast this program, Winning Over English, but for some certain reasons, we could not continue this program. But uh, in the month of Ramadan, we like to start the program now with episode seven. Today's guests, uh, two guests will be uh, with us, Zarin Zara Khan from Chitang Government Women's College and Sanjina Khan of Simla, Bangladesh Navy College, Chitang. So I like to welcome both the guests in 20 Minute Online College platform in our program, Winning Over English, episode seven. Uh, I hope that both the guests will join with us. Zara, we can see she is with us. Welcome, Zara, Hello. to our program. Hello, Assalamu alaikum, everyone. I'm Zarin Zara Khan from Chittagong Government Women's College, grade 12. Okay, uh, now we like to uh, invite Sanjina Khanam Simla. She is also our uh, guest today. We like to talk about our everyday life, their daily activities, class activities, and other activities. Uh, Shimla will join with us very soon. We can hope that she will be with us. Now Zara is with us. Yes, Shimla is with us now. Shimla, welcome uh, to the show, Winning Over English. Can you hear me, Shimla? You are on the show, Winning Over English. Sanjina Khanam Simla is with us. Yes, sir. Welcome you to the show. OK, let's start the program with Zarin Zara Khan. Zarin, introduce yourself. Already you have introduced yourself in a brief manner. i like to hear from you a further bit introduction from you. Zarin, introduce yourself. You are a grade 12 student. Uh, from Chittagong Government Women's College. You are in business studies group. Tell us something about yourself also so that everybody can know us because you all know that this is Winning Over English. You are free to express yourself in this uh, program and you will express yourself in English. Everybody knows that. So uh, let's start with Zarin Zara. Zara. Uh, hello, I am Zarin Zara Khan. Uh, I'm here today for to introduce myself to talk with you guys in English. Um, okay, gradually we will know uh, many things about Zara as the uh, program goes on. Now we will go to Shimla. Shimla, can you hear us? Yes, there might be some problem with the network. She will be with us very soon. We will get Shimla. Let's continue with Zara. So Zara, you are in Government Women's College. You are a second year student. You are in business group studies. And yes. you are preparing for the HSC exam, isn't it? Preparing for the HSC exam for the pandemic situation. All the class activities are not uh, continuing. For this reason, online activities are going on. And a revised syllabus or condensed syllabus has been, give, has been given for HSC exam 2021. Now, uh, my question to you, how are you preparing yourself for the exam, HSC exam 2021? How is your preparation? Uh, I'm preparing myself for the HSC exam. I already finished all the syllabus and now I'm revising all of them. Yes, you are revising, but how, what is your technique? Because you are not going to the college, you are not in connection uh, with the teachers. Via online uh, maybe classes. You, online classes. Via online. Are, you, are you really enjoying the online classes? Uh, I like online classes, but I would prefer offline classes or 
yes okay shimla is with us uh, shimla can you hear me yes sir okay introduce yourself shimla introduce yourself uh, okay hello assalamu alaikum everyone uh, first of all ramadan mubarak to all uh, i am sanjina khanum shimla and i have passed my ss examination last year from alhazia kubali girls high school and college and i'm currently reading in bangladesh novahini college at 11th grade Uh, well, in nature, I am easy going, and I'm highly ambitious, and I have lots of hobbies. I have lots of dreams, so I'm very much excited to be here. A <laughs> little nervous too. Thank you. That's all for me. Okay, thank you very much, Shimla. As you have mentioned, you are a class 11 student from Bangladesh Novahini College Job Program, and uh, you are also doing what I was asking. Uh, Zarin Zara, that she was also continuing her classes, online activities, online classes, no offline activities. You are also in the same position. Are you really enjoying the online classes and online exams that are conducted by your institution? Uh, sir, honestly speaking, I used to enjoy it, but uh, by the time it becomes really, really not so, I'm not so in favor of it. Like I would prefer the live classes. Uh, uh, as uh, doing online classes for a long period have uh, has spreading bad effects on my health. That uh, some some days before I was suffering from headache and neck pain. And the doctor, uh, when I take a doctor consultation, and he said that it is due to my online classes doing due online classes for a long period. So I really don't like it uh, very much. But yeah, in this situation, there is no better alternative of online classes. So we we are complete. Okay, really well said that we we have uh, had no other option open to us because online activities or online classes is the only option to connect with the students. Uh, so thank you. I will go to Zara. Uh, as we are talking about online classes and online activities, uh, so how are you enjoying the online exams? Are there any online exams in your college, Zara? Sure, online exams. Yes. Uh, I don't prefer online exams because there is many ways to cheat on a online exam. So I would prefer the. Online class more than the online exam because it doesn't help us. Okay, so the main point of view is that there are lots of options, there are lots of facilities uh, to cheat in the online exams. So my question to Zara: Do you really miss your college? As uh, uh, sometimes it it we find we can find that. Students do not like to go to college, uh, but now I can hear that they are missing their colleges, college environment, college friends, and they are also missing the lectures of the uh, teachers, etc., etc. Uh, do you really miss that, or because it, it like that for a long period of time you are not going to college? That's why there is a feeling of uh, missing or miss a kind of missing feeling uh, in you. Is it only for that or something else, or do you really miss your college, the college environment? Uh, I really miss my college, but there was a time when I, uh, I, it was really boring when I was in college. I, uh, I miss my college. I miss my friends mainly, then the classes stuff. Teachers mainly my canteen, then everything I miss. My miss my college. Okay, so you miss your canteen very much. Why? What? What are the items uh, in the canteen you are missing? Special anything items, special? Uh, uh, no, 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 not for the items. It's mainly for that we used to hang out there. So I miss the every. I miss our hangout mainly. Okay. So what about Shimla? Shimla, can you hear me? Are you missing your college? 
বাংলাদেশ নৌবাহিনী কলেজ সাবচে ওয়ান্ডারফুল কলেজ ফ্রম আউটসাইড ইনসাইড ডেকোরেশন ইজ অলসো পারফেক্ট অ্যান্ড এনভায়রনমেন্ট ইজ অ্যাবসলিউটলি পারফেক্ট সো আই থিঙ্ক দ্যাট ফর টু অর থ্রি ডেজ পারহ্যাপস ইউ হ্যাভ বিন ইন টু দ্য কলেজ ফ্রম দ্যাট ডে ফ্রম দ্য ভেরি ফার্স্ট ডে অন ইউ আর নট গোয়িং টু কলেজ সো what kind of feeling do you have about your college what kind of impression because all the impressions are only from online online and online have you got my point similar similar can you hear me sir i can hear you uh please Yes. Have you got my question? Yeah. Are you missing your college very much? So why are you missing the college or can, and college environment? Simla. Uh. Can you hear me, Simla? Okay, let's go to Zara again. Perhaps there is some kind of problem in the device of Simla. Uh, Zara, can you yes. hear me? I, I, I hope you can hear. Yes, sir. Sorry? Uh, yes, sir. Um, okay, so if I am missing that, I never, I don't have any memory in my college. And... I didn't get any chance of we just go for there for admission and the state. Yes. Yes, sir. sir. So can you have no, you, yes, I can hear you. You have no memory of the college. You have only gone for the admission and some other purposes, as I have mentioned, for two or three days. So as, as you have no memory, uh, all the memory is in your, all the, no, yes, sir, yes, I can me? hear you. Can't you hear me? Can't you hear me? Uh, okay, then there might be some problem with the device. We'll come back to you again. Shimla, I'll yes, go sir, to sir, Zara. Now I can hear you. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? I can hear you very clearly. So can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Um. Yes, continue. So can you hear me? I can hear you. You continue. You go on. Proceed on. Carry on. Okay, Zara. We will be again yes, connected with uh, Shimla. Zara, I hope you, are, you can listen. Okay. You can hear me. Uh, now, my question okay. to you, what extracurricular activities do you prefer? Mention some of the extracurricular activities. Apart uh, from your study, I basically sing. And yes. This is a uh, main thing. I used to do debate when I was in co- uh, school, and mm-hmm. uh, uh, that's it. I haven't do any other extracurricular activities. So singing and debating are your. favorite past time or extra curricular really activities the singing. apart from uh, i'm not at all good in uh, debating debate i mm-hmm. uh, at times you are involved in debating in school you have uh, mentioned uh, already yes. now my question to you uh, extra curricular activities helps a student extra curricular activities help a student very much Uh, do you agree with this statement yes i do because it it helps us in many ways uh it will uh help us mm, it, uh, when i we do uh, extracurricular activities it uh, uh i mean it relaxes us it gives us some kind of refreshment Yeah, Isn't it? refreshment plus uh, 
it en- yes. en- en- enhance our uh, skill. Mm-hmm. Okay, I have got your point. So for refreshment or skill development, uh, this is a kind of additional practice. Uh, that's why students are involved in extracurricular activities. But in our um, in recent time, we can see that most of the students do not like to be involved in extracurricular activities uh, because. Uh, they are very much involved with some other uh, devices, mobile devices. Now, mobile is very much available because of the online classes. So uh, my question to you, how long do you um, give, uh, how long do you give time to mobile? Your mobile phone gets how much time out of 24 hours? Uh 24 hours 20, most of the times are, 20 hours uh, 20 hours or 12 hours 20, no 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 not 20 hours not 20 hours uh, uh, at okay, least five to, se- 5 to 7 hours 5 for to 7 hours for classes okay. and uh, for classes mainly not other activities no no not or for, chat, not, uh, for classes <laughs> And also for, uh-huh. uh, also for other. Okay, so Shimla is back. Can you hear me, Shimla? Our device is okay. in. Yes, sir, I can hear you. Okay, in problem. She was in problem yes, with her device. Now it's all right, I hope. Can you hear me now? now- I can hear you very clearly, and before that, I was also hearing you very clearly. Now, both of us can hear. That is the main point. Now, my question was to you uh, uh, that uh, the online activities for the online activities, we use mobile phone. Apart from uh, online activities, how long do you use mobile phone out of 24 hours? As I was asking Zara, the same question. Shimla. Okay, uh, sir, if I say a minimum, I use three hours a day. Uh, okay. Minimum three hours only, a day. Uh, only other three than hours. Online activities. That's all. And actually, okay. <laughs> actually, my mom scolded me for that. <laughs> That's why. Mm. So I can't touch it uh, long. I try to, but it's not. Yeah, and I have so many pressure. We have so long syllabus and uh, too short time. Okay. And so that's why I can't get a uh, chance to have it. Okay. The main main point is that uh, study pressure and the pressure of your mom. For these two reasons, you are not using mobile phone not more than three hours. So if those pressures were not, perhaps you uh, you would have used mobile phone or other uh, devices for uh, five, seven, or eight hours a day. Okay, who knows? Now, let's talk about your hobbies. What are your main hobbies, Simla? Maybe. Hobbies? Maybe. <laughs> Sorry? Uh, sir, as I said, I have many hobbies. Uh, I like drawing. I like drawing, paintings, and photographies. Um, I have lots of hobbies, as I said before. And I I love to do drawing, paintings, and I also do photographies. I have a garden of my own, that, and I do gardening. I, and I love to read books. And I have really read books uh, in this pandemic time. Lots of books, too. Lots of books. You have a habit of reading books. So can't you hear uh, me? Yes, I can hear you. You, you, you. you have the hobbies of reading What's books. That? So Yes, I can hear you. I can hear you. So how many books you have already read? How many books you have already read? Yes, sir. In this pandemic time, how many books? If I ask you in numbers. And also, you can name some of the books you have read already. 
in this pandemic time. Shimla. I think she can't hear me. Shimla, can you hear me? Sir, she is uh, mute. She muted his call. Oh, I see. You have to unmute yourself. Shimla, you have to unmute yourself. Unmute your device. You are muted. Unmute your device. Unmute your device, Shimla. You are muted. So it is automatically muted. Uh, so okay. Tell, tell us the name of the books you have already read. Tell us the name of the books you have already read. Um, some some books. Okay. As you I, are, uh, I have read. You are read mentioning. The, Okay, sir. Uh, I have read Johi Raihan's Shesh uh, Me. Then I have read uh, Humayun Ahmed's uh, Deal, Outliers. Mm -hmm. Then J.K. Rowling's Harry Potter. Uh, it is uh, then uh, I have read the translated version. And mm -hmm. um, and yeah, then I have read Shomurish Mujumdar's Gorbudharini. And uh, there are many more. Okay, so many books. Now, one serious question now to both of you, Shimla and Zara. Why do students not like to read books apart from their textbook? All the students love their textbook very much because there is a um, system of getting marks. But for outside reading, there are no marks, but you can gather knowledge, you can store up your knowledge. So why don't the students like Reading, as Shimla was saying, she has read so many books in this pandemic situation and before that. So why don't students love to read books? First, I like to go to Zara. What do you think? Because they are prone to the mobile phone mm -hmm. and they use their mobile phone much. And <clears throat> apart from their main study, they... Uh, Usually they don't don't get time for maybe not sure they don't get time for reading books so and maybe for this reason they don't uh, read books. Okay, Shimla, what do you think? Why don't the students read books? So uh, from my perspective, yeah, I will agree with Zarabu um, and. The, it may be due to pressure of the studies, the uh, academic studies, and and yeah, they are addicted. They like to uh, pass their, spend their free time in browsing, in internet or scrolling Facebook rather than gaining knowledge. And as you say, sir, that it do, don't give us any marks or it uh, doesn't. So they don't understand the benefits. Like if I say I can't. Read. I want to read books, but I can't read books due to my academic uh, lessons pressure. So I think this to the, all the students uh, face the same problem. If they want to, they can't get time or any chance. Like this. Okay. Thank you very much. Now uh, we like to listen because you have already mentioned that both of you love singing. Uh, I like to listen a song from Zara first and then from Shimla. Start with Zara. We are talking too much, but we are not listening. As, uh, so uh, many entertaining things. Let's sing, uh, listen a song from Zara. Of course, it will be so a, this is a song. an English song. Yes. Sure. Would this you is please? a song uh, named Demons from the Imagine Dragons. Mm. When the days are cold and the cards all full down the saints, we see our world made of coal. When your dreams all fail and the world we hail are the worst of all, and the blood runs stale. 
This is my kingdom come. This is my kingdom come. When you feel my heel, look into my eye. It's from a demon side. It's from a demon side. Don't get too close. It's dark inside. It's from a demon side. It's from a demon side. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. This is. Such excellent singing, wonderful singing, Zara. Thanks a lot. Now we'll go to Shimla. Let's listen a song from Shimla also. Okay. 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 Uh, first of all, I'd like to say that forgive me for my bad voice. I am not a professional singer. Okay. I want to sing a song from the movie Greatest Showman. I close. Close my eyes and I can see the world that's waiting up for me that I call my own. Through I know one's been before, but it feels like home. They can say, they can say, we are, I have gone crazy. They can say, they can say, I've lost my mind. I don't care, I don't care, so call me crazy. We can live in a world that we design. Every night I lie in bed, the brightest colors fill my head. A million dreams are keeping me away. I think of what the world a vision of the one I see. A million dreams is all it's gonna take. Oh, a million dreams for the world we are gonna need. Okay, wonderful singing, Shimla. Thank you very much. So, both of you sang very well, excellently. And of course, accidentally you have uh, sung. So, dear viewers, you are with us in 20 Minute Online College. We are from 20 Minute Online College Streamer Studio, and this program, Winning, Winning Over English, Episode 7, is being telecast. Uh, and we have two guests with us, very young guests, one from Chitong Government Women's College, Zarin Zara, and Sandhyana Khanom Shimla with us from Bangladesh Nawahini College, the program. And this program is being live telecast, as I have already mentioned, from 20 Minute Online College Facebook page. And there are also uh, two platforms from where it is being telecast. They are simultaneously 20 Minute Online College YouTube channel and BSKRPD and the students and many more viewers are with us. They are watching, I can see. Many of them are giving their reactions. Janna Tulfetos are with us and um, saying Assalamu Alaikum, Wa Alaikum Salam, Samia, Didar, Tanisha, best wishes for both of you, and Abdul Momen. Assalamu Alaikum. Many of us, uh, many of the viewers are actually giving their reactions. They are enjoying the program. This is the program actually for the youngsters so that they can express <coughs> themselves in English. It is a bit difficult because all the time in 24 hours, we actually speak Bangla in our daily activities at home, in the classroom, for the students of Bangla medium, I am telling. So we from 20 Minute Online College have felt the necessity that at least in this program, for 30 or 40 minutes, the students will speak in English about their selves, their hobbies, their likings, dislikings, etc. That's why this is the program. I hope both of you follow 20 Minute Online College. Do you follow? Zara and Shimla? Yes, sir. Okay. Sir, can I just repeat? Yes, Do sir. you follow 20 Minute Online College, both of you? Yes, sir. 
yes you have told that both of you follow 20 minute online college uh, how much do you like 20 minute online college why do you like and if you have any dislikings for 20 minute online college some of the programs you can mention which program do you like most because you follow i have seen i have seen in many programs you are giving your reactions so let's start with sara uh, tell us something about 20 minute online college uh, <clears throat> i really like 20 minute online college i really appreciate who took the initiative to create such a wonderful a uh, platform for the students uh i may, i personally like the winning over english uh, most than the career quest than the non di non di tar kotha i mainly uh, love this sessions okay any any of the sides you don't like you can mention also sorry from 20 minute online college uh, facebook page there are many programs can you mention one or two programs which you don't like because of some reasons are there any program like this we also we also uh, we also gave lectures also class lectures uh, for five days out of seven days uh, to be very honest i haven't watched them i just watched the uh, winning over english uh, uh, sessions then the non di tar kotha and the career quest okay okay thank you very much now But over to shimla them. okay okay thanks shimla yes sir yes sir i think it is a wonderful and a standard piece of um, piece of place for in the online um, platform and uh, it really it the classes are am so amazing the teachers are so good and i really like it and if i say about my favorite uh, show in this, in 20 minute online college that it would be entertaining essence i like this show very much i like the guests who sing their their and yeah and i really don't uh, think there are i from my perspective there are no negative side of 20 minute online college i like all the activities thank you okay thanks a lot so as you have mentioned no negative activities these are the po positive points of 20 minute online college and we are very happy that you like the programs especially uh, shimla has mentioned that the classes online classes she watches i will request zara that you can from today on you can follow the online classes also you will uh, all the classes are in our archive in the platform in the facebook page you can see that you can watch them you will be definitely benefited i can assure you and from today during the ramadan a program will start not actually the program this is the program of tilawat khatme quran uh, from from today at 5 pm this uh, this tilawat will start because of the ramadan we have we are going to start uh, this so everybody i i will request all the viewers to uh, listen the tilawat one of our a uh, student from bangladesh novaini college of program ex students actually he has passed the hsc exam last year uh, he will uh, uh, continue the program actually i request all of you now let's come to the uh, some other points so we are actually running out of time uh, the um, <coughs> future plan everybody has some aim target in their life so what's your uh, goal and future plan shimla fast So, um, as I said, I I am a very ambitious. I have lots of dreams. So the my first motto will be to become a good and honest person and uh, an independent girl. And whatever I do in future, always want to make my parents proud. And if you say about uh, career plans, uh, I always had a, a confusing mind on this in this regard. Uh, I mean, I my mind always keep fluctuating in this case. So, but yeah, I everyone should have a goal, and my goal is. to become a doctor uh, actually it is this is my father's dream uh, but i want to be a doctor in the defense force i want to join the defense force medical corps and i really i, I had a soft corner for the defense force so and i want to be a doctor so why not defense force medical corps 
So inshallah, someday I will make it. Okay, inshallah. We also hope that. We also expect that your dream will be fulfilled. You will be a doctor, good doctor, a doctor for the humanity. Actually, doctors should be uh, saluted, should be given salute because they are rendering a great service to the nation in this pandemic situation, risking their lives. You, you all know that. So salute to all doctors. And we hope that Simla will also be a good humanitarian doctor in the long run. Now, what's your future plan, future goal, uh, Sarah? Sarah. Uh, I want to be a lawyer in future. Why? Why do you want to be a lawyer? Is there any specific uh, reason? No, uh, there is no specific reason. Uh, I want to be a lawyer because I have seen my brother, my uh, my my nana. I sure. saw them that they were uh, so much, uh, they did struggle. So, and and one of my uncle is justice and I saw him that he's doing really such a good uh, in his platform. So I want to be a lawyer. It, it made okay. me to be a lawyer. Okay, you, you from the practical life experience of your relatives, your grandfather's lifestyle, you have seen that and you have realized that uh, for living a standard life, uh, you have to be a lawyer. This is another point. We hope that actually you will be a lawyer in future. We hope so. Uh, now, uh, we are at, in the end of our show. Now, my question, before the final question, it will be the second last question too. Uh, Shimla Pass, mention some of your uh, positive qualities and negative qualities. Uh, some means actually you will mention three uh, positive qualities and three negative qualities. Three positive, three negative. Okay. I know it's be a bit difficult okay, to I mention the negative qualities. Also, uh, if I say that my I have said my first three qualities, it would be I am an easygoing girl, uh, hardworking mm -hmm. and fast learner. And the negative sides would be I'm a little obstinate, uh, a little bit lazy too. And mm -hmm. the other. I, one, one quality, uh, only. One, one negative quality, you like, obstinate then? I'm lazy. I'm really very lazy. Okay, <laughs> lazy. Sometimes being lazy is also and good. Then, because uh, you know the me, story. Like I'm and I yeah. The third would be I'm yes, very I, much um I I very fastly uh, I get addicted very fast. I think this is my negative quality that uh, something if I uh, I like something I get addicted to it. Very okay, you are addic quickly. addicted to your you are addicted <laughs> really to your amazing. likings. Yes, yes, thank you. You are addicted to your likings. This is you think that this is your negative yes. quality. But when you mention I am addicted, some people will think that there will be some <laughs> kind of another kind yes. of addiction this is this addiction is for your liking the things you are liking most you are addicted to it very much you are doing it time and again that's why you are calling it addiction so that's good but it has become very difficult i have as i have told to find out the negative qualities so zara what's what are the negative qualities of uh, you and the positive qualities also first the negative quality is um too much lazy I and and I have a, a egoistic problem. Then what? What problem? Ego. Egoistic problem. Egoistic problem. Uh, Ego. I, egocentric. It is. It is called in English egocentric. 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 Yes. Egocentric. Then um, what are the qualities? And the positive quality is um, friendly. 
and and uh, another negative quality is I trust people easily. Okay. Uh, and positive, positive. 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 Um, no positive qualities, maybe. <laughs> no positive qualities. <laughs> I really can't it's remember. Very it's very difficult to believe that you have no positive qualities because you are speaking English so wonderfully. You are a tension free girl on the on the screen. You are wonderfully speaking so many things. These are the positive quality of you. So many positive qualities I can see. Thank so you. Why can't you find any? Why can't you find any positive qualities in you? Okay. Anyway, so th thanks a lot to both of you because. Uh, you have attended the program uh, excellently, I would say. Uh, at times, of there, there, there were some problems with the nets. These are the uh, very natural problem in the uh, online world. We have to accept this. So, final uh, question to Shimla. Tell us something. Our final remark we want to hear from you. Tell us something about the program, about your audience, the audience uh, who are with us, I can see that right now we have 26 audiences, live audiences, those who are uh, listening to us. Thanks a lot to them because they are listening to us in this time. Everyone is fasting. Both of you are fasting, I hope. I am also fasting. So in this situation, we are talking, they are listening. Uh, these are a great work and this work is actually for the improvement of our English. Apart from that, we want to speak in English. We want to show the people that we also can speak in English. Our students can also speak in English if they are uh, given the platform and uh, given the facility. Now, uh, Shimla, the final comment from you. Uh, okay, sir. Uh, thank you for and I hope I have overcome much more. Uh, I have overcome my energy over English much more ex extent. And I'm really humbled to be here. Thank you, sir. And thanks to the uh, 20 minute online college for having me here. I really had to uh, spend a good time. Well, thank you so much. One. Okay, thank you so much. And your presence has made the program uh, a wonderful program. And we also like to thank our uh, partner that uh, what we call inspirational partner or motivational partner, Babuni, a Canadian uh, food and gourmet company. We like to thank them. And we also like to thank uh, the uh, people who are working behind the screen to make the program a very effective one. And especially, I like to mention one name that is Yao Roman assistant professor and head of accounting department of Bangladesh, um, uh, Pebza Public School and College. Actually, the name of the institution is Pebza Public School and College. He is the uh, mastermind of the, all the programs and all the setups are done by him. Uh, so thanks a lot to him. Now we will hear final remark from Sarah. Um, I really loved the <clears throat> I really loved the whole session today and thanks uh, 20 minute online college for inviting me here and it uh, helps me to overcome the nervousness while talking in English and thanks to our host thanks to the whole team of 20 minute online college and uh, I've, uh... Sir, can you hear me? Yes, yes, I can hear you. Continue. So your camera is off, I guess. No, no, no. My camera is on. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, so. Um for inviting me and I would I would share the 
I would share this to all with my friends because I have a I had a great time with uh, with Sanjina Khanam Shimla and with uh, our sir Imdadur Rahman. So thank you, everyone. Okay, thanks a lot. So you have mentioned that you were a bit nervous and nervousness has been uh, reduced or redeemed. Now tell me one um, thing. This will be the final question. This will be the final question. Who were the most nervous person in this session? Me, Shimla, or you, Zara? Uh, uh, maybe I'm the one who is a bit nervous. Okay, this is your generosity. And Shimla, who was... Who is the most nervous person in this session? Me, the host, you, Shimla, and Zara. Who is the most nervous person? <laughs> okay. Everyone is saying and me. Shimla is saying she is the nervous. most. Uh, okay, she is the most me. nervous person. And Zara has said that she is the most nervous person. And I have to I also. And I think it's yeah. pretty normal to be nervous here because it's our first yeah. live. So Very good. It's normal. Okay. I think that my personal view is that both of you were not nervous. Actually, this is because of the situation. For the first time, as you have mentioned, that you are on the screen. But for the first approach or as the first approach, what you have done, after the program, you will see the... Uh, uh, video you will see the video clips there you will see how wonderfully you have performed in this program so thanks a lot uh, for appearing at the program for attending the program and made the uh, uh, platform so gracious uh, for your presence and finally i like to tell all our uh, viewers uh, thanks because of their uh, presence right now i can see many viewers are still are with us they are watching it and they are appreciating it. They are giving so many comments that they are enjoying the program. So thanks a lot. In the next uh, program, we will meet again next Tuesday probably. Till then, bye-bye. I love this. Yeah.